It's currently 6 a.m. I woke up about 5.30 a.m. Just because I really wanted to start a morning routine again. A couple months back, I used to wake up around 5 a.m., 4 a.m. every day. And it became a habit, but after a while, I kind of lost that, you know. And so now I'm just trying to get back into it again. Making sure that I use my time wisely because... As you all know, we only have 24 hours in a day. The earlier you wake up, the more time you're able to use. And so, you know, gotta do what we gotta do. We wanna get to where we wanna be. So right now, I am currently headed to the gym. We'll see where today takes us. Normally I get double shots of espresso, but today I got a triple shot, so let's go. Ah, oh, this shit is so disgusting. <laughs> Let's get the day started. Yo, what up guys? So currently it is about three o'clock. I'm already kind of dragging. The triple espresso shot that I took this morning is kind of wearing off, but gotta keep it moving. Got work to do. Working on a couple edits now, and I have to go back to um, my little brother's Brazilian Jiu Jitsu school. I'm supposed to be taking some pictures for him and see what we can create. The main reason why I'm trying to start waking up a little bit earlier is because I am making up for lost time. I feel like in the past I've wasted a lot of time and now it's almost the end of the year, so it's now or never. I have really big plans for the beginning of next year, so I gotta come with it. So we do what we gotta do and we don't make excuses. So let's get it. You know, we only got about 140 days left of the year, so it's now or never, baby. So see you guys in a few. What up guys? So this shit went great. It's always dope to surround yourself around people who really push you and inspire you to work your craft, you know? And I'm very fortunate that I've met these people and them giving me a chance to just be able to create dope things. Now again guys, in no way am I a photographer or aiming to be a photographer, but I truly believe that sometimes you have to prepare for the opportunity. Come next year, I have some really big things planned and I'm just trying to refine little things here and there so that when next year comes around, I'm ready, you know? And that's the way you have to approach things. It's just preparing for the opportunity, preparing for the moment because things don't always come as you plan them. So you have to be ready, you know? When that moment comes, it's like, it's not time to practice or anything, it's time to go. So yeah, guys, two things. Prepare for the opportunity and use your time wisely. So keep those things in mind as you go through your journey. That's pretty much it for this video, guys. Man, we're almost at 100 subscribers. Like I said in the past, it's incredible watching this channel grow. And let's continue to build. If you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe. Make sure you like at the bottom. And if you have any suggestions, be sure to leave them down at the bottom. But that's pretty much it. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I will catch you guys on Monday. Have a great weekend. Peace. <laughs>